Hello, my name is Ian Kenworthy. I'm really proud to be able to introduce our Sixth Form Academy to you. It is a centre of excellence and we here at CSIA are very proud of it. We frequently ask our students what they feel about our Sixth Form Academy and why they chose it in the first place. Well, there are many reasons they give. First of all, the outstanding teaching that takes place. Uh, the students have confidence in their teachers and know that they will have an excellent learning journey. Secondly, they will experience wonderful pastoral support because in the two years or three years that they stay in the sixth form, there will be times when things may not go quite so smoothly and they will need support and guidance uh, on, on that journey. It's very, very important. The sixth form is also a, a, a social community and the sixth form committees organise lots of events throughout the year, Halloween evenings, uh, film nights, there's the Christmas ball and the summer ball. And that all helps to create a real spirit of community, which is very, very important. The sixth form has an outstanding set of academic outcomes. The results are very good, both at A-level and BTEC. And again, you only need to look at our DFE website and, and actually see just how well the school performs. Always, virtually always in the top 10% of schools nationally. And our students go on to some of the top universities in the country. Students in our Sixth Form Academy are treated as young adults and again our staff, the relationship between staff and students is very good indeed. Our communications with students and parents and carers is excellent. Our watchword is there should be no surprises. All are kept well informed of how well the students are doing and actually if there is a need for extra support or discussion or dialogue between students, parents and carers then the school is always there. We keep you informed and up to date. The other thing is very important is the fact that the transition from GCSE to A-level or BTEC is quite a leap and for some students they need that extra support on that early part of their journey. We're there for them. We don't just set them a test five weeks in if they don't make it, move them on. We're there for the long haul and our students continue that journey for two years or three possibly and actually go on to achieve and feel success which is very, very important. We take in many, many students from other 11 to 16 schools. Those students settle in very, very quickly. We have an amazing induction day. And over the years, students coming in from other 11 to 16 schools do exceptionally well in their A-levels, BTECs, and then go on to great things at university afterwards. It's a great place to be. The Sixth Form Academy has a very, very wide catchment area. Yes, we take a lot of students from Camborne, but students will go that extra mile to get into our Sixth Form Academy, and we take students as far as field as Padstow, Truro, Penzance, uh, St Just, uh, uh, down from Mullion as well. So we have a very big catchment area. Students, again, choose us because they're discerning, they want a good ed education and, and they want to succeed. Sixth form life is, is, is not just all about academic qualifications. I've mentioned our social events and activities that the students organise, but we also offer many other wonderful opportunities. We have our international programme with opportunities to take uh, part in maths challenges, science challenges or just exchanges all over the world, including countries like China, Japan, South Korea, Thailand, Singapore, Australia, uh, Canada, Russia and Holland. An amazing programme. We have the Duke of Edinburgh Award Scheme, which is incredibly active in the sixth form and many, many students go on to take the silver and the gold award uh, successfully at, at our school. We also offer some amazing scholarship opportunities where students actually apply to take part in an activity or something that would change their, their lives. And we evaluate that, often myself, the head of sixth form and the head boy, head girl, and award sometimes up to a thousand pounds so that students can actually live their dream. And if you look at our prospectus, you'll see that some of the students have done some amazing things. So there's something here for everybody. Our sixth form academy is an amazing centre. It's a centre of excellence. Our numbers are growing very, very rapidly. And we are a very serious option for anyone considering post-16 education. I commend it to you. Thank you very much.
Hello students, parents, carers and families. Welcome to our sixth form open event. My name is Sarah Belshaw and I'm one of the vice principals here and along with the sixth form management team help to oversee the sixth form. I really hope that this video will help you make some more decisions about your educational journey next year. So many of you who are listening are already students at Camborne Science and International Academy and already know the other students and staff well. However, I would like to extend a warm welcome to those of you who are listening to us this evening from schools outside of Camborne. You might not know that 25% of our intake this year was from students who came to us from other schools. You'll be in great company. It's a fantastic community. You'll settle in quickly and you'll make lots of new friends. So a little bit about our sixth form. Importantly, we're a thriving sixth form, growing in numbers. At 220 plus, we're able to offer a wide and varied curriculum of some 35 subjects, but at the same time, retain the smaller class sizes that our students so highly value. The opportunities that we can offer our sixth formers are unique and allow them to take part in experiences and travel that are not available elsewhere. Our students are treated as young adults and the sixth form provides them with spaces where they're able to study and socialise separately from the main site. The students will tell you that they have really productive relationships with their teachers because they're given the independence they need to grow into young adults but also the support when things don't go quite right or as expected. Our teachers are incredibly enthusiastic about their subject. They are subject specialists and readily available for help if needed outside of the classroom. As a consequence, through the hard work of our students, and they do work really hard, but with that support from the teachers, our students go on to, inc um, to achieve incredible outcomes. I'm always excited to talk about the Sixth Form Scholarship Programme because I know that it has a massive impact upon students' uh, progression, well-being and opportunity. The Scholarship Programme enables students to access a grant of up to £1,000 to do something that is wonderful. It's not means tested which means that we focus exclusively on what the student needs out of the scholarship in order to make sure that they can go as far as possible when they leave the Sixth Form Centre. And part of that is making sure they can go as far as they like whilst they're here. We've had students that have gone as far afield as South America, Polynesia and as near as Truro. We recognise that a large number of our students may wish to access our facilities uh, from further afield than just Camborne. So we have a transport bursary available to all of our students to ensure that they can access our wonderful facilities. That transport bursary might enable you to get a bus pass or a train pass or it may support you in getting some contribution towards the cost of fuel. There is no barrier in terms of distance to accessing the Sixth Form Academy at Camborne. So the Sixth Form uh, is really keen to ensure that people can work, rest and play. We've got a common room and coffee shop where there's an opportunity for collaborative chat and conversation. Uh, we also have a silent study area and a study support area. And for those students who need a little bit of financial support to make sure they can purchase books or other academic materials, there is a means-tested bursary available upon our application as well. Hello, my name is Paula Tippett and I look after the international programme at CSIA. We have been working with partner schools around the globe for a great many years and we have very close ties particularly with Japan, Thailand, South Korea, China, Australia, Canada to mention but a few. So you might be presenting an academic project that might be on the theme of science or maths or humanities. It might be in the form of some research through a poster presentation where you might be in a large hall with a range of international schools um, where you're presenting to your peers and talking in an informal manner. Or it might be a more specific research project that you're presenting with your team um, to a panel of Nobel Laureate Prize winners in Singapore. On the other hand, there might be the more social side of the international programme that you're interested in. Staying with uh, foreign families in their homes, finding out what it's really like to study at that particular international school. It might be just an exchange for cultural purposes. It might suit your sixth form needs to expand your portfolio for the CV for your dream job of the future. All these experiences and uh, travel opportunities are open to everybody in the sixth form. 
So please come and talk to one of us about all the international opportunities that are available to you. You know, where in the world uh, can we take you? If there's a particular destination or something to support your studies that you're interested in, please come and talk to me and talk to many of our staff. They are very well travelled throughout our international uh, partner schools and community and we're very much looking forward to taking you somewhere exciting. Hello, I'm Mr Douglas, Director of Outdoor Education here at the Sixth Form Academy. We've got some great opportunities for you to get involved in outdoor education here. The main one is the Gold Duke of Edinburgh Award. It doesn't matter if you've done the Bronze or Silver Award, you can jump straight in at Gold. Uh, there's loads of different parts of the award, but we, uh, we've got some fantastic expeditions up to North Wales, Dartmoor, maybe even further afield. You might even summit uh, the top of Snowdon as part of your expedition. We've also got the 10 Tours Challenge. So in the Sixth Form Academy, you'd be looking at the 45 or 55 mile event. You've got to cover that distance over just two days across Dartmoor. So pretty tough challenge and we'll train you all year for that. So I look forward to seeing you out on the moors or the mountains um, when you come to the Sixth Form Academy. Thanks very much. Hi, my name is Megan. I'm a current Year 13 student hoping to study acting and film at the Royal Holloway University of London. One of the reasons I chose to come to the sixth form was the opportunity to become self-reliant, independent and responsible. I was delighted to be elected the director of the student leadership team and I'm really excited to chair meetings and plan social events such as the variety show, the winter ball and the Halloween cake sale. As a sixth form, we try to organise as many events as we can in order to include our sixth form community. Hi, my name is Tristan. I came from Penna School and I'm head boy here at CSIA. I'm a student at CSMS and I'm currently applying for computer science at Cambridge and Harvard in America and I've gotten lots of help in my application from my tutor and the rest of CSMS. This year, I'll be attending the Japan Super Science Fair and Singapore International Math Challenge online despite the pandemic, owing to the success of the sixth form's international programme. Coming from Truro, it was a huge step to come here, but I made the decision because of the excellent support available and the small class sizes. Hi, my name is Shira and I'm in Year 13, hoping to next year study History and Sociology at Manchester University. These past two years, however, in the sixth form, I've been able to do great things, like going on a trip last year with my friend Asia to London, Paris and Oslo. We would not have been able to do this trip, however, without the sixth form offering us our scholarship which went a long way in paying for this independent trip of a lifetime. Hi, I'm Rex, and I continued my education at the Sixth Form Academy due to the sense of cohesion and community that I experienced in my education at the Camborne Science and International Academy. Here at the Sixth Form, everyone is treated individually, and therefore they get a tailored experience that then allows them to achieve their current aspiration. I personally don't know what career plan I choose to take in the future, however I know I have loved studying sociology and psychology here at the Sixth Form and I know that I'll be put on the right path by the Sixth Form team. Hi, my name is Neve and I'm a Year 13 student. I'm hoping to study English and Drama at the University of Exeter or another Russell Group University. I was really pleased to be selected as head girl at the start of this term. I chose to go to sick form as I knew it would be a grown up experience as the teachers treat you like young adults and the classes are much smaller. There's plenty of time for you to be independent, use the study facilities and meet your friends in the cafe. I was really happy at CSIA, partly due to the fact that I was on the international programme attending the Ritz Makin Super Global Forum in 2018 in Japan and I wondered why should I go anywhere else if I'm already having such a great time here. Hi, my name is Beatrice and I'm in Year 12, hoping to go to university to get into the fields of either dance or sport. I'm really enjoying being here at the Sixth Form as we have all settled in really quickly and it already feels like home. The induction day was great and no matter what school everyone went to, we got to make new friends and get to know each other. I'm also really enjoying the extra opportunities like the sport academies, for example myself, I'm part of the netball academy which I'm really enjoying. Hi, my name's Emma and I'm a Year 13 student st currently studying Biology, Chemistry, Geography and EPQ. I have just sent off my UCAS application to secure a place on a dentistry course. It has been quite a stressful process but I've had a lot of help from my tutors, pastoral team and subject teachers to help choose universities best suited for me and polish my personal statement.
Hi, my name is Harry. I am a Year 12 student. I am aiming to be a professional cyclist and compete in the Tour de France. Uh, choosing my A-levels was quite complicated, uh, more than most Year 11s, because I am a cyclist competing at national and international level events. I need really good support from the sixth form. Uh, I need to be able to have the help balancing my academic studies and uh, whilst enabling me to compete and train uh, for my competitions. The first few months have really proven to me that I've made the correct choice, settling in really well, uh, being able to smash course records and compete at a really high level at national competition. Also maintaining really good grades, uh, the sixth one wouldn't let me know. Hi, my name's Jacob, I'm in year 12 and I'm studying computer science, maths and physics. I came to the sixth form from Pool Academy. Initially, I was worried about making friends, especially because I didn't go to Camborne Academy, but after the induction day, I met everybody in my tutor group and we all got along really well. I really made some really good friends. The atmosphere here is welcoming and I'm looking forward to completing my A-levels. Hello, I'm Tallulah, a Year 12 student here studying Maths, Further Maths and Biology, who came from Mounts Bay Academy. I decided to study here due to the great academic opportunities that I get at CSMS as a STEM student. At first I was very nervous, but as soon as I got here I found my lessons very challenging and interesting and my teachers very supportive. I'm very glad I chose to study my A-levels here. Hi, my name's Dan Chapman and I'm an assistant principal at Camborne Academy and the deputy head of Cornwall School of Maths and Science. I want to take this opportunity to talk to you a little bit about CSMS and explain why, if you're thinking of studying at least two science or maths A-levels, it is the best place to study in Cornwall. CSMS exists to give able students the very best opportunities and the best chance of progressing to the top universities. We make sure lessons here at CSMS are really targeted at the top end. We give students the opportunity to really practice those A and A star skills. We have teachers who are subject specialists who know how to get the very best out of able students. And our students are attentive and ambitious. Alongside these amazing lessons, we also have an incredible co-curricular program. Students here at CSMS are given the opportunity to attend academic lectures. These are delivered by visiting researchers who come to us from universities across the country, including Bristol, Cambridge and beyond. Alongside this, our students have the opportunity to become researchers themselves. This means that our students carry out academic research, which they can then take to international science competitions. Last year we won an award at the Asian Pacific Conference for Young Scientists. Alongside all of this, we have some specialist pathways which exist for students who know exactly where they want to go in the future. For instance, if you want to be a doctor or a vet, you'll want to join our medical and veterinary pathways. Medicine and veterinary science are some of the most competitive courses in the UK. Universities have up to seven applicants per place. So if you want to stand out in that field, you need a lot of support in ensuring that your personal statement stands out, but also that when you go to interview, you know exactly how to present yourself. Students on those medical and veterinary pathways are given all of that support and more so that they have the best chance of success when making those applications. We also have the Oxbridge pathway. Now the Oxbridge pathway is for students who are highly ambitious and hoping to study at Oxford or Cambridge in the future. These universities are also really competitive and the interview process is notoriously difficult. What we will help you to do is to build the experiences that you need in order to be successful at those interviews. For instance, when our visiting researchers come to deliver their lectures, you'll have the opportunity to work one-on-one -on -one with them, practicing the, uh, the communication between you and a researcher. We also work intensively throughout Year 12 and 13, preparing your applications and helping you prepare for those interviews. One of the main strengths about CSMS is the fact that we are part of the Sick Form Academy. This means that you are not limited by the choice of A-levels and you therefore can choose from any of the subjects on the Sick Form Academy main campus as well as choosing science, maths or computer science here at CSMS. We hope that you've really enjoyed watching our video. 
and that you've found out some of the answers to the questions that you might have wanted to ask us. However, if you do want to find out more, then please check out our prospectus online. You can also find out um, the entry requirements for all the courses that we offer online on our website. If you would like to find out more and um, have a tour of our sixth form facilities, then please contact us either via the website or at sixth form inquiries at camborneScience.co.uk and one of our senior leaders would be delighted to meet you, show you around and answer any questions that you may have. In the meantime, I would like to thank you for your time and I hope that you will get in touch if you do have some more questions for us. Bye-bye.